the result of deep water culture is this. This is a 21 day old plant in the system. It's in a three inch net pot. It has a tremendous root structure. It's formulated in a cocoa core and vermiculite compound. We're gonna show you how to make it. One of the true benefits about year round outdoor deep water raft culture uh, it can be scaled down to a very small sustainable home system or brought up into where here I'm operating in 3,000 square foot buildings. Here we're growing an all natural product that we're totally in control of. Uh, there's no chemicals, there are no uh, uh, outside influences, there's no pesticides. I use a heirloom seed, a non-GMO product. So being in control of that benefit right there is superior to anything that you can do. Part of the magic of aquaponics it really revolves around some simple record keeping and we can show you an outline that's going to fit for you whether it's in your lifestyle like it is here for me uh, I, I live where I work or if it's a, sta a sustainable thing for your family where you're interested in cultivating food for yourself so it's up to you to figure out your own outline but I can show you how to plug all those times in Any good hobby is, is five hours a week, and you can make this as small as a hobby or take it as far as you want. So the harvesting is really simple, folks. Um, there's a giant root structure inside of here. And this piece is no older than uh, 21 days in the system. And that's, again, without the germinating time. But this is a really healthy, sturdy piece. We take it to market live. We uh, will trim the, the root structure off of the pot. This allows it to sit comfortably in a bin on a table. Uh, this probably weighs 13 to 16 ounces. Once people start to see aquaponic food and you get a loyal following, um, this is not an exaggeration. In my local market, it's a four hour market, um, I can sell out in two and a half hours. Other farmers are standing around me in amazement. And uh, when you see a farm stand that's full of live, rich food that has not been separated from the ground. Uh, dirt farming has its problems. Water farming doesn't.
This is a Nile tilapia. He started at eight tenths of a gram, or roughly a gram. Now at seven months old, he's tipping out at well over a pound and a half. This is an all male, male on male. It's a wise I got. He's fed uh, a vegan diet. He's reared on uh, 40, 30, and 32% proteins. His yield is tremendous. Um, we are able to produce over and over again fillets that run between seven, six, seven, ten ounces. This is a skinless, boneless product. 